Reps. Emmer, Finstead and Fishbach vote against expelling Rep. George Santos Minneapolis, of the eight U.S. representatives from Minnesota casting their votes in Friday's expulsion of Rep. George Santos, three of them voted against his ouster. Time equals, 400 Ms. greater than Minnesota's delegation to the U.S. House of Representatives is eight, in total, and they're evenly split between Republican Party members and Democratic Party members. On Friday, three of the four Republican members voted against removing Santos from Congress, Reps. Tom Emmer, Brad Finstead and Michelle Fishbach. The fourth. Republican member of the delegation, Rep. Pete Stauber, voted in favor of Santos' expulsion. Three Minnesota Democrats voted to remove Santos, Reps. Angie Craig, Betty McCollum, and Ilhan Omar, but the fourth Democrat, Rep. Dean Phillips, did not vote in Friday's proceedings. Phillips is currently pursuing a primary challenge against incumbent President Joe Biden. Minnesota DFL Party Chairman Ken Martin called out Finstead's vote in particular, saying, it is embarrassing that Brad Finstead would vote to keep George Santos in Congress despite the scathing bipartisan ethics report confirming the overwhelming evidence of his unethical and criminal conduct. Over 100 of Brad Finstead's Republican colleagues recognized that George Santos was unfit to serve, but he turned a blind eye. Among Wisconsin's delegation, two Republicans, Brian Stile and Glenn Grothman, joined the state's two Democratic Party representatives in voting in favor of removing Santos. The remaining four Republican Party representatives voted against it. In all, House lawmakers voted 311 to 114 in favor of the expulsion resolution, including 105 Republicans who voted for it. Two Democrats voted against expelling Santos. Dozens of Santos colleagues were apparently swayed by a damning report from the House Ethics Committee released two weeks ago that found there was substantial evidence that Santos repeatedly broke the law. Santos brazenly embellished his biography to win his seat in Congress last year and now faces nearly two dozen federal charges related to alleged fraud and illegal use of campaign funds. The bipartisan vote makes Santos just the sixth House member in U.S. history to be expelled in the first in more than 20 years. Representative James Trafficant was removed from office in 2002 after being convicted of 10 corruption-related felonies.